Welcome to beginningprogrammer.com YouTube videos. Here's another great video, beginning C++ quick primer. This is how to shuffle an array. So let's get started. In the last video, I showed you how to do a random number generation and how to get random sets of cards. This time, what I want to show you is how to shuffle a deck of cards. We're not gonna do a whole deck. Let's just create an array and let's say we had values let's just call it deck and let's say we had 10 values so we can say this and we have let's put them in order and 10 so we have a deck and we can display the value so we can say from 0 to 10 and we can display the deck And we, we are just going to dis display the deck as it is. And everything looks right. We have deck, we have one, two, three, one through 10. We have from zero to 10 and we display the deck. Let's see if this runs. So we have one through 10, but what if we wanted to shuffle the deck? So let's create a, a shuffle function and let's call it shuffle. And let's go ahead and receive an array of, of cards. So we say int, and not it's not a deck of cards, it's just an array, so let's call it, but let's stick with that and let's call it deck. So if we want to shuffle a deck, we have to do a for loop. What we do is for int i equals zero. And we know our length. Typically when you have it uh, an array, you pass an array, you have to pass in the length. So let's pass in the length. And we can say for i equals zero, i less than n, i plus plus. And here we can say, we can shuffle the deck. So what do we do? We need a temp variable. When, when you do a swap, we have to swap two cards in the deck until we swapped all cards and we need a temporary value. So let's go ahead and do that. We'll have a temp value. And here, we take the first item in the uh, in the array and we put place it in temp. So we take that and place it in temp. And now next what we do is we take deck and we take deck i, we're gonna override what's in deck and we're gonna swap it with a different card. So we take that and we, we assign it something from the deck. So we can say at this point, we can say take a random value out of the deck and we need to hold the random value index. We can't just use it there. So we say in and we can say random index. We can initialize it and let's get a random index. Random in index and we take in rand it and we, ran we, we mod it by the length of the deck and this will give us a random index. So we take the random index, place it into i. Since we place the, the value of random index into i, next we take deck, and we are gonna put the, ran the temporary value in random index, and we place temp into that. And this should handle our shuffling our deck. Let's see if it works. So let we have that, let's shuffle it, and let's see what happens. and we pass it the value because we have two parameters. So we have to shuffle the deck. Let's see if it runs. And you notice we have a deck that's shuffled now. We have one, six, and we have all, we should have all the values. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And it's just that easy to go ahead and shuffle a deck of cards. If you like this video, go ahead and like it. If you don't like it, if you, if, or if you have a question, leave a comment below and I will get back to you. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe so you can watch more great videos on beginningprogrammer.com channel on YouTube. Thanks for watching.